As we head into lake season with our sunscreen and sunglasses, storm tracker meteorologist Jared Piepenberg recommends a good pair of polarized sunglasses. In this week's Weather Wednesday, he takes a look at the science behind those unique frames. It's been many times I've been out with my, my friends and I'll look up in the shallow water and I'll see a bass cruising up there and I'll tell them, you know, cast to it. I'll look back and see them looking all over the water because they don't see it. And that's when I realize they aren't wearing their polarized sunglasses. Oop, there's a bass right there. I can see him swimming. Pretty good one too. Come on. Yep. Called it. Really good one. So fishing with polarized sunglasses is a must. But what is actually happening and how do polarized sunglasses work? When light reflects off the water or other surfaces, it becomes polarized. The reflected light is actually vibrating more in one direction than others. Polarized sunglasses reduce this reflection or glare, but the sunglasses have to be oriented properly. Actually take your sunglasses and turn them to the side or even tilt your head, you'll be able to see the glare come back on the water. When lenses of polarized sunglasses are made, they add a chemical film or actually embed this into the lenses. This chemical filter absorbs incoming horizontal light while allowing the vertical light. This reduces the glare you would normally see. With this week's Weather Wednesday, I'm Storm Tracker Meteorologist Jared Piepenberg. Interesting. I yeah. don't know all of that. I, I have heard from him talking about fishing and fast <laughs> fishing that, you know, that's just as important as his tackle box. But uh, yeah, I didn't know the science behind those polarized.